Thank you so much for picking me up. Yeah, no problem. Hey, on the way home, we can stop by my new house and see what it looks like on a Tuesday. All right, great. Okay, I just gotta go pick up my books. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. No problem. I'll be right here. <sighs> nice to see you again, Maria. Hello, Mrs. Laferty. Oh, welcome. What is your name? Uh, I'm Joey. Joey, you have a wonderful accent. Thank you. Joey, this is an English as a second language class for beginners. Are you sure you're in the right place? Oh, I'm in the right place. Let's get started. I hope that everybody practiced counting to ten oh, over yeah. the weekend. Yes. Yes. Great. Let's do it together. One, One two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Very good, boys. Somebody's going to get a gold star. Thanks. Thanks. 13, 14, 15. <laughs> Go to sh school, Renata. They go to school. Okay, Joey, why don't you pick it up where Renata left off? Now, this is a hard part, so take your time. Oh, boy, yeah, this is this looks tough. Uh, the bell rang, and the students all went to the auditorium with their teacher. Boom! <laughs> That's right, Boris. You heard it. Auditorium! I am so lucky to be with the smartest boy in class. Some words are so tug. Tug? Oh. Remember I told you the G-H sometimes sounds like an F. It's tough. Like rough. Or laugh. Oh, Joey. Make love to me too knifed. <laughs> That is good English. Okay, like everybody, to take out their homework on the subjunctive tense. You didn't do it? I got it. If the present tense of the verb to be is I am, then the subjunctive tense is if I... Joey? If I was. Oh, I'm sorry. That's not correct. <laughs> It's, a uh, if I were. Very good, Boris. <laughs> Joey, you're stupid. <laughs> Joey is stupid, Renata. 